now to reopening schools and some very good news for seniors who will be graduating in just a few months. Hundreds will be able to walk across the stage to get their diplomas during an in-person event. All the graduates will be together. Action News 8 reporter Alani Latang takes a closer look at how one school is preparing. She's live in SoCal tonight. Mm -hmm. Yeah, Aaron here at SoCal High School. It's back to the normal spot for graduation, which is their outdoor stadium here. But there's a lot of details to work out from pre COVID screening to where everyone is going to be sitting. And after the non traditional year that these seniors have had, some created uh, a lot of challenges that created for some of them. The message about in person graduation is unanimous. They are, they are very clear in their desire to all be together. Excitement is mounting at SoCal High School. Planning for an in-person graduation is underway. It's a shift from the drive through graduation they had last year. For the class of 2021, it'll be held at their outdoor stadium on May 28th. There will be one ceremony for the 262 senior SoCal Knights. That'll follow the California Department of Public Health commencement guidelines. Those include wearing masks, social distancing, and determining how many people can attend the event. Right now we are, we are estimating and, and just trying to come up with different numbers for capacity for, for, our, for our stadium. And we're just looking at you know, different, different, uh, different strategies and different um, opportunities for our graduating seniors. You know, I'm, I'm comfortable with doing an in-person graduation. Susan O'Hara has a senior daughter graduating from Pacific Collegiate School. It's unclear what the school's graduation plan, but the clearance for an in-person celebration paves an exciting path. There is um, a ceremony that not only the kids you know, are a part of and really look forward to, but the families and the community that have been behind the kids through their learning experience. I think that my senior would really like to see her classmates and have an opportunity to um, go through that ceremony together. High schools in Santa Cruz will be working together on their graduation ceremony plans over the next several weeks. The Santa Cruz City School District says the planning will include input from families. The district superintendent says it's an important, exciting chapter for students to close out the year safely with their classmates. It's one of the best days of the year where we're marking the time where students are celebrating their achievements over the last uh, 13 years of their education. I, I am just looking forward to being being in a stadium um, with them as a group um, so that I can address them and express to them my, my, my appreciation for their resilience. And something that's really going to speed up those plans is they actually don't have to turn in those plans for a county health approval. So it's really going to be all hands on deck building a plan in order to honor these graduates safely and keep everyone else that comes to attend safe too. Aaron, an exciting time for those seniors. Thank you, Alani.